What's going on guys? Welcome back. So I heard that you all were super curious on how to make a really good present farm and me and a buddy known as Noob uh, near you, uh, he's another minor save and tester, we have pretty much made the perfect um, present farm. I, I, I assume there's maybe one better out there. If you guys know anyone better, uh, post it in Discord. Um, but yeah, make sure to like if uh, you liked the video, dislike it if you didn't and uh subscribe all right let's get into this so uh you're gonna need an hourglass uh if you want this to go really really fast if you don't have one don't stress it it's not a requirement um use some kind of uh really good sword giver and as always use champion infuser if you don't have champion infuser for whatever reason please for the love of god use like resetting infuser with zenith will or something good at least make sure you'll be able to get there fast because you need to get there fast if you're using hourglass um if you're using hourglass and you don't have champion infuser you can't do this uh the right way um at least so if i were you if you don't have champion infuser don't bother using hourglass unless you somehow can manage to do this with double zeniths or something but i highly doubt you could do it with anything else um I know there's a few ways that you could do this without uh hour uh without you know champion infuser by using hourglass which requires the teleporters you could just teleport up to santa pretty much with this thanks to my friend joe for telling me about that but honestly it was still really weird um i don't use that it's just not my thing all right let's make this setup so um what we need to do is get these out just like this um you are gonna need that centering conveyor by the way and a large converter ramp so get those out now first off right underneath the silicone mine we are going to give uh down a video game digitalizer and then um ah, shit what are they called oh north star um you're gonna need three north stars and then an ore wrapper. Shit, did not know why that happened. And then you're gonna get out a teleporter. All right, now um, go over here, place this down, go to reborns. Um, we're gonna place down our fruitcake blaster, the uh, digital peppermint, a Santos work clock, an ice crusher, an aromatic refiner, uh, the new snowflake wheel, and then a large converter ramp with two of the candy cane cannons on the side. Yes, it will hit, by the way, don't worry about that. Um... What else? What else could we do? Oh, yeah, we need, um, chamber. Uh, we need the frostbite chamber. And then a Santa's train. Then you're gonna need to go into the shop, go into the machines section. You're gonna want to buy a snowflake suppressor and an igloo refiner. Shit, give me a sec. Alright. Um, you're gonna need igloo refiner. Now, a uh, snowflake suppressor, igloo refiner. Um, then get the the new blizzard predictor, a frosted refiner. I'm pretty sure that's uh, the name of it. Yes, frosted refiner. A cryolist, and then your green teleporter. This is the entirety of the setup. It's pretty, pretty short. Um, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna press Z, let the uh, present, you know, come into the setup. It's gonna go pretty fast. All right. 
So now we have our present. What we're going to do is we're going to grab this present and then press Z on the mine right before we go over to Santa. Now, how this works is once you press Z, you're pretty much on a timer. You have to exchange the gift fast enough or else it's not going to spawn with another present there. Because if there's two, if there's already a present existing underneath your character's name, um, it's not going to spawn in the second one. It's just going to exchange it for money and you'll just get like $16,000 or something. So you press Z, run over as fast as you can, um, and then exchange it right away. You don't have to press X up here, by the way. It just kind of happens itself if you run away. And then the more and more you do this, the faster you'll get. It just kind of takes practice, but it's super efficient. I already managed to get everything. I got all the relics. I got everything. Um, it's a good setup. It works. Um, there's probably, again, there's always somehow better, but this is good. Um, it works. I don't see a reason not to use it. Um, but it, it definitely does the job. Now, um, for anyone who doesn't have all of the, like, hourglass and champion infuser and shit, I'm gonna give you guys a really good way to do this. So... Instead of using Hourglass, what you'll do is, if you have this, you have to have this or else you're not going to be able to do this with Hourglass. Um, you need a Mystical Teleporter. You're going to press Z, press Z, go up in here, run over to Santa as fast as you can, and exchange it, and then run back to your base. Oh, shit, it didn't exchange. Uh, it's a little bit faster to get there by doing that, but... Honestly, I just prefer the normal way of, uh, you know, running to Santa. I feel like you don't just teleport with a wall stuck in front of your face. It's not as fun. I'd rather just run over there and just hope I get some good luck, honestly. But it's not horrible uh, just to do it normally. It's, it works. So thank you to everyone who uh, contributed to this. Um, this was... This uh, setup build was pretty much like a collab between me and uh, Noob, so uh, it worked out pretty well. He basically gave me the baseline, and I just managed to make it a little bit shorter, but it's still pretty good. Uh, thanks uh, for watching the video, and I will see you around.